Some toy donation centers have been facing an issue with a shortage. Peoria's outcome may look different. Yeah, with just two days left to help with the Toys for Tots campaign, Celestelle checks in with how donations are looking. More people in central Illinois are making sure kids have a wonderful holiday. Toy donations for the Toys for Tots campaign in Peoria and Tazewell County are up compared to last year. While that's good news, more toddlers and teens are in need. Tiffany Chambers with Toys for Tots shares what she's been seeing this giving season. I can definitely say compared to last year with the organizations that I'm working with, they're seeing double if not triple the amount of numbers. So therefore they're asking double if not triple the amount of toys this year. Threads Hope and Love one of the nonprofits that work with Toys for Tots received plenty of toys for toddlers. However, the amount of gifts for teens is on the shorter end. President and co-founder Cindy Schufert tells us about this shortage. That has been definitely way down this year and um, we're getting a lot of merchandise. We just aren't getting the gift cards like Walmart cards that help the kids get more, more special things that they like. Threads Hope and Love accepts clothes throughout the year, but during the holiday season, it is taking monetary, merchandise, and gift card donations through mail or in person. For 25 News, Sayla Estelle. And coming up.